in a world where everything is changing. Two brothers are about to create something that could alter the course of human history. Or at least Broadway. Something Rotten is the story of two brothers who are playwrights living in the shadow of the greatest playwright that the world has ever known, William Shakespeare. I am the will and the scale Shakespeare is like a rock star. We always talked about him early on as being a cross between Mick Jagger, James Brown, Tom Jones, and a little bit of Austin Powers. We want it to be the Shakespeare that you've never seen before. One of the brothers is so desperate to get a hit that he goes to a soothsayer and he predicts the future of theater will be musicals. They set out to write the first ever musical, and hilarity ensues. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight. We're gonna have this soothsayer, what if it's Nostradamus? And we looked up, was he alive then? I was like, no, it was uh, about 80 years earlier. Hey, what if he had a nephew? Nostradamus is like eccentric, eccentric, a bit senile. We talked about Christopher Lloyd and Back to the Future. Uh, maybe Billy Crystal and Princess Bride. Casey Nicola was such a perfect fit for this show. Casey had done Spam a lot, and he had done Book of Mormon, and we were like, yeah, that that guy would be great. The show really does pay tribute to the art form because I love musical theater so much, and so do the writers. <laughs> It's really the kind of show that I just absolutely live for. I think what's fun about the show is I think it's for everybody. You don't have to know anything about Shakespeare. You don't have to know anything about musical theater. This show actually works if you love Shakespeare and if you hate Shakespeare. This is a version of Shakespeare that I don't think you've ever seen before. So now you can write, right? Wrong, you're not even close. You remember the damn it your play's gotta be in I have the contaminant. Everyone seems to really have a good time at the show. And you just hear the audience going crazy, and it's so much fun to see and hear. There is nothing like live theater. Just to, to see how the show is different every night, the audience reaction, the fact that people were cheering and laughing. That's what it's all about. From the co-director of the Book of Mormon and the director of Aladdin comes something outrageous, something completely original. This Renaissance means rebirth. Something rotten. Broadway's funniest musical comedy in at least 400 years. And then five years ago, someone told us we should make this whole thing hip hop. And we said, that will never work. <laughs> and it wouldn't have if we had <laughs> if done we it. Had done it. <laughs>